Oh yeah, we are finally back. Back for some more Super Mario 64. Let's play Super Mario 64, I should yeah. say. And I am Tennis Bubba 13. Mario was just excited to see me and hopefully all of you guys again. Man, I can't even like say how many times I've been like, hey, it's been a while. But, <laughs> but anyways, today we're gonna hopefully try to finish up uh, the rest of uh, Shifting Sandland for today and then hopefully make our way to the next area. Uh, but for now, let's go ahead and just get started with mission four. Um, and I'm actually not gonna be doing this mission. I decided, I'm thinking I'm gonna do some uh, uh, the 100 coin missions, and since this is going on, I might as well just talk about what's been you know going on. Uh, since I really haven't been doing this game for quite some time. Um, for those of you who were around on like my Twitter, uh, I did say, unfortunately the bad news is that I'm canceling uh, Pokemon Mega Ruby because it's not that I don't like the game, it's just I feel like I've been, you know, sort of uninspired and I feel like I've done so many of the third gen Pokemon series for quite some time. I did a let's play of uh, Pokemon Sapphire and Pokemon Emerald which were both on the third gens. Uh, but, you know, I, I just felt like I, I kind of rushed a little bit with that project because, well, it's, I started that game like a month before, it, or a month after it was released, and I didn't feel prepared whatsoever. So, there you go. It's been, it's been cancelled, and I'm pretty much going to be just sticking to this game for now on. Um, and then hopefully later on we'll get to some more Let's Plays, but right now, we got to finish this game. Uh, so, I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to just start collecting some of these coins here. Um, and then, you know, you know what I've been really doing, like, all these times with the coin, 100 coin montages? Um, I decided to, for this case, I'm, I'm not going to be doing that. I'm not going to be adding music to any of this because, well, I'm already talking about things and <laughs> it's been a while since I've talked about anything in regards to my life in general. Uh, that's okay. I appreciate you guys for sticking around. Hopefully you um, are still around for this Let's Play. And um, in general, just some other things that I do. Um, I've, I have been starting to do some more Smash 4 uh, videos and other stuff. So hopefully you guys enjoy those as well. Um, and so on and so forth. So hopefully more things to come in the future. But for now, uh, let's just keep flying around. <laughs> uh, what I'm going to be doing... No! Mario's just stuck. <laughs> I'm actually gonna just uh, get all these coins for uh, for the outside and then I'm gonna be just focusing because a lot of the coins in this level are gonna be inside the pyramid and uh, I'm basically gonna be getting uh, some of the coins outside here including, including the red coins. I'm not gonna be getting all the red coins but uh, <laughs> some things I said about this level before. I think I might have said this like last episode how this level is kind of interesting, but at the same time I'm not really a big fan of Shifting Sandland because just a lot of the missions require the coin caps. Plus I had some bad memories of this level just dying a lot <laughs> because of the quicksand. You don't you don't want to fall in this dark quicksand right here or else that's uh, that's it. Game over. <laughs> Also, the other thing I hate about this level is the red coins that you have to get um, with the wing caps. It's a little bit ridiculously hard to control, a little bit with the wing caps sometimes. Uh, you know, it's not so bad. You're just basically flying in a square pattern just to collect these coins anyway. So uh, I do it just because I want to get the 100 coins out of the way. Um, and I'm also going to be taking care of another mission inside the pyramid. Uh, so yeah. Get number six. Luckily, I don't think this vulture here will steal your wing cap if you are equipped with the wing caps. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Didn't really think about it too much. Like, what happens if the vulture just like hits me and uh, I lose my wing cap and I'm gonna have a hell of a lot of trouble <laughs> with that. Also, I guess I could probably talk about what the hell has been happening to me. Like, I recently just had mouth surgery, uh, so. I am fine. I'm able to talk now. 
Uh, but the downside is I'm gonna have to be on a liquid diet for a few days, so hopefully by this time that my mouth is fully healed, I won't have to worry about that anymore since I'm finally eating real food <laughs> and so on. But yeah, that's basically what's been going on with me. I had a little bit of a mouth issue at the moment and uh, kind of blame myself for that, for not going to the dentist as scheduled, so that's beside the point. The, uh, the real point is that we're finally inside the pyramid and we're going to tackle the rest of the coins. Because I really just don't like the 100 coins in this level per se. Uh, if you mess up, like if anything can go bad as well in the pyramids too. Like I really don't want to have to like restart this. And I, thankfully I don't have to. Since I'm looking pretty good. Um... But you can get, like, there's plenty of coins inside the pyramid, like, at least, I would try to at least get that, uh, above, like, 50 coins if you can, um, before you go inside the pyramid, that way you don't have to worry about it too much. You now there's just some minor obstacles here and there that you have to deal with, um, as well as the quicksands, the, the mummy flumps, uh, these little, uh, I don't even remember what these guys are called now, <laughs> these little guys that are just circling around here. That's beside the point. Uh, but yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and just finish off getting the 100, 100 uh, coin star. That's probably gonna be it. Then there's there's another star that you must get. And this one, I'm actually gonna do this star. Uh, it's the star that requires you to collect like these these coins in a specific area, and it activates like a special secret. Um, yeah, this, this part right here requires that star. Um, I'm actually gonna be... <laughs> I'm actually just gonna take care of that out of the way. That way I can just... not have to worry about it later. So let's just go ahead and grab these coins here. I already have 80 coins, wow. It's amazing. Um, that's another thing I haven't really mentioned, is the, the whole fact... I don't think I might have talked about this, but the 100 coins in, in general... I really don't like this idea. And I really don't like it in Mario Sunshine, how it's brought back. I'm glad they kind of removed that in Galaxy. Um, you know, it's it's always a bothersome, just going around collecting coins. It's good for, like, racking up lives and everything, because every 50 coins you collect, after you finish a star mission, you get, like, you get, like, an extra life, basically. But if the fact that you have to do this for every single level is really, really tedious. And some levels are kind of ridiculous. Really, really dangerous. <laughs> but um, this level is a pain, and later on down the road, it's gonna get worse. I feel like. Um, but yeah, we're almost done. We only have like a few more coins to go. And we're just about ready to climb all the way to the top here. And we just gotta deal with uh, that little coin spot. If I can get this camera, yeah, that little spot. Uh, <laughs> Like, that's one of the main reasons why I don't like shifting sandwiches, because if you mess up this star, uh, you're gonna have to just, you're in a world of hurt. Do I even have enough? Oh no, I don't. So I'm gonna have to do this. Jump down, come on. There we go. Would you look at that? I'm just 100 coins, finally done. Yes, yes, 100 coins, collect, save. This is the tricky part. See, this took me a while, like, I guess for some reason, like, you have to be really careful. So if you just move a little bit slightly forward, uh, back and forth, then that's how you land. Uh, always ground pound, just to make sure. So you, have to, you don't have to worry about taking dump, uh, fall damage. But this is what I was talking about. You have to collect those coins specifically, and this star over here appears. And that's, I think that's the last star for Shipping Sand Land. Hey, look at that! 64 stars. Yeah, <laughs> sweet. So that's Pyramid Puzzle. That's, I think, the last mission. Anyways, let's just go back. Continue. Alright, guys. We're actually gonna do this again. I actually messed up. <laughs> this is the second uh, take doing this. It's so weird, because when I originally did this... Okay, so the first try, I got, um, I stand on the four pillars, nothing happened, so, 
We're actually gonna just retry that. And then for some reason I grabbed the shell over here. And I was like, I think I can just go back on those pillars. And actually and accidentally like hit one of those spots where he takes you to this like dark quicksand or whatever. So, note to self, just use the wing cap. <laughs> You have to stand on each pillars in order for this to work. I don't know if you have to collect the coin or anything, but uh, as long as you're like on top of the, of the pillars, then you should be fine. So, I think we're on the last one right here. Yeah, so I think what I'm gonna do after this um, is I think the last one after this star is the red coins. I think that's gonna be it. We still have this other star mission in this pyramid. So it's kind of an interesting, <laughs> kind of an, I wouldn't say interesting, kind of a, uh, you know, well, you'll see in just a second. But it's nice we get like a little elevator uh, to take you to the star. And what's down here? Oh, nothing unusual. Oh! I see how this is. <laughs> Who walks there? Who breaks seal? Wake agent ones. We know like fight. Arr, we know like intruders. Now battle. Hand. Two. Hand. Yeah, I don't know what these guys are called. Basically, just hit them where they're opening. That's pretty much that. <laughs> these guys are pretty simple. Just follow this pattern back and forth. If you mess up, I'm pretty sure like they'll try to push you off. Because this is a pretty small area. See like that right that guy right there. Oh jeez. Oh man, that was close. <laughs> uh, what happened? We crushed like pebbles. You so strong. You rule ancient pyramids for today. Now take this star of power. We sleep. Darkness. Pretty creepy for those guys. Eh. I can blame him for those guys that just live in this pyramid. You see nothing but the light. Yeah. Just give me that star. <laughs> Alrighty, so hopefully if I'm right, this should be the last star. If not, then... Oh well. It is! Perfect. So this is the eight red coins. Um, so let's go ahead and get that started. The first coin, believe it or not, it's actually behind where you started. You gotta be careful, because if you if you are aware of the controls in this game, one one false move and you're slipped, are dead, just dead. All right, so the other star or the other coins, <clears throat> the other four coins on the ground are kind of simple. I'm not so sure if I'm gonna be. Eh. I think maybe I'll just take care of the stuff, the coins on the uh, on the air. Nah, I'm actually going to just get those other three out of the way on the ground. Because the ones on the grounds are kind of harder to get than the ones in the air. Just because you got to deal with, like, this stuff right here. <laughs> These little blocks. Ugh. But a nice, simple bomb jump. Got to be careful. I think the, fir the fourth one... Yeah, it's over by this. I don't get it. It's like this weird... <laughs> this, this weird puddles. Uh, just right there. Oh, God. Great. <laughs> Thanks, Vulture. I don't think I mentioned this, but... Uh, when you lose the hat, um, I think you take some more damage. Could be wrong on that. Alright, so... We're gonna actually do a little shortcut. Just to get back to where we were. That's right. Right, that tornado. <laughs> Perfect. Let's grab this. I think I'm actually going to be heading towards the cannon. Just to make it a little bit easier on me. I'm really not so accurate when it comes to <laughs> just, you know, triple jumps. Because you don't get much height. It's better to just do it from the cannon. another hat just in case 
haven't really like calculated like how long that how long you last with the hat, so it probably really lasts like a couple of minutes, I would say. <laughs> yeah, see, it's just so hard to control. Even when you're like trying to dive down, it's so hard to maintain like your position and everything. So I think the other two are just on the other side. This one I missed. <laughs> Yeah, just going so slow. I kind of prefer the flying mechanics more in Mario Galaxy than this game, per se, because I don't think there was anything in uh, Sunshine besides the hovering nozzles. So, I really like the power ups more better with the, uh, <clears throat> with the Mario Galaxy. It's not that I don't like the wing cap, it's just a little bit. I wouldn't say, yeah, probably this star thing in the galaxy is more easier to control. So I was trying to think, maybe maybe they're the same. <laughs> maybe they're just like the same kind of mechanics, but just you know, different power-ups. Let's just fly right into the star. Boom, done. I think we're all done with this place, finally. <laughs> so that's it. Corsa done. Never have to come back to this place ever again. It's one of my, it's one of my worst. One of the, yeah, it's one of the worst. <laughs> but anyways, now that that now that we're pretty much done with all this stuff here, we finally have way enough stars. We have plenty of stars to open this star door right here, but we're not gonna do that. We're gonna do that next time. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys stuck around. Until then, I will talk to you guys later. And peace out.